Hi friends, welcome to Tutors Funny channel. Today I am going to teach Node.js part 3 tutorial. We will discuss about what is a function and arrow function. This is very must when you are, are a good developer in Node.js, right? Let me see step by step. So first, how to create the function? How to create the function? We have a keyword called function. The function has a name. So let's take example of a b c this is a function name function as bracket right so after the open and close close bracket this is the structure of the function function which is a keyword and function as a name and brackets open and close bracket inside the function we have print i'm going to print the hello as a message now I have print I have printed a hello message so how to call this function we have to type a b c open and close bracket now if you save all now let's call it here now here run the application node index.js hello has been printed hello has been printed hello has been printed okay hello has been printed okay okay note index.js hello has been printed what you are written inside this back uh, function this message has been printed hello right okay this is how we have write the function now function consists of two parameters we have function this is the empty function function we have implemented the, with the parameters so how to implement the parameters you have to type para 1 comma para 2 okay now here i am going to if you have put the parameter inside the parameter this is a function you have to pass two parameters here now here also i am going to type two numbers 10 comma 20 right in the console what you're going to do is here you have to type param this param this param okay right now you can see the output what this output will be now right now again i just copy this second one paste it below second param okay what's the value of param one it goes to here set the first parameter as 10 here print at a, it has been printed at 10 as display it goes to 20 here the 20 has been printed here now let's file save all let's run it first time 10 printer second time 20 printed now let's add two params so you have to write console dot log param one param two file save all 30 has been printed. 30 has been the answer. 30 will be the answer. Okay. The 10 goes here. 20 goes here. 10 plus 20. Answer will be displayed as a 30. This is how the function works. Right. Third one. I am going to explain the return. So how the function return so this must you have to know about these things i'm going to remove all the things right now here how the function return you have to write the return right hello right now what you're going to do is now let's print off this how to print this one so you have to write you have to call the another you know, variable i'm going to call const b equal we have to equal into this function now what i did here is a return what is the return this function return hello this all the function calling to put into this variable b now i am going to print out console.log b now let's look at the answer sir what will what would be printed hello has been printed hello has been printed right 
now i am going to add two numbers so 5 6 plus 5 what will be the answer it will be 11 it will be passing here it is assigned here 11 has been printed now, now let's file save all 11 has been printed right okay this have we have created the function right now apart from this we have create the arrow function apart from this we have created the arrow function so arrow function how to create the arrow function here simple things the same here you will be you, you observe this one this is very important here this is a function this function you will get this copy this from here you just copy these things function name this sorry all things i just copy all the function i just copy control c copy pass it here okay pass it here now you can see function function name here this is the things right so how how would we work this one how how, how to work this very simple so how to work whatever is now how to change this function as arrow function we have to remove the function name first we no need the function name and we no need the keyword of the function right okay we have removed that that's two things function name uh, function is a keyword and function name we have to remove instead of that we have to implement the arrow instead of that we have implemented the arrow okay after implemented this function as with this function converted as arrow function this function converted as arrow function now now how to print the answer now now we have printed the other same thing here i'm going to create whatever other things we have to call let call the function which is a call we are called here right like this here same thing const i'm going to create a variable something variable b a here to pass this function same thing this function b this function we have to pass it here okay we have to this function we have called the function now this keyword so this is a return we have to write a console dot log then only we have a we have to we have the this this function will be added the answer how to print out so we have to this function we have to assign to this variable now we will be printed now let's file save all now let's get the answer 11 will be the answer simple right now here you can see here the same thing you have to do it here now here the same thing here so I'm going to write to the console dot block here inside this bracket. Hello, the same thing. Now you can see the answer. Hello. So write called B. File so save all. Let's print out note index dot is what will be the wrong sorry why this is text we didn't write the double quotation mark that's it that's the wrong now let's file save all hello has been displayed right the same thing if you are passing the parameter as well, params params one comma params Two. Let's implement this. Thirty comma sixty. What happened? We have to print it here. Param one plus param two. Now let's file save all and back to the answer is ninety has been printed. Perfect. It working perfectly okay now you have an idea what is the arrow function and function this is must when you get the industrial experience okay this is very must when you uh, become a good non-js developer these are all the things you must know when you are go to the industry you must learn these things okay so you have to get the practice this all the thing what i did today you have to practice 
right thank you for watching uh, now i am going to before that i am going to do a simple exercise you have to print your name using the arrow function so how to print your name using arrow function const name okay i have explained this only how to create the arrow function now you have an idea how to get the arrow function function you have a keyword arrow open and close bracket here you have to write console dot log print your name tutors honey right now how to call this function name the name call that's it now let's file save all run it back the application again here i have written two times that's why it had here here second time here tutors funny has been printed here i have called this function here i also above also the second function also i called that's why that first results and second result that two, both are displayed right very simple you have to practice them i hope you guys will understand things thank you for watching